Track storms to alert you first. This is KIMT Storm Team 3, weather coverage you can count on. Hey, welcome back. Meteorologist Travis Clark Smith is in for Aaron tonight, and we're looking ahead to the weekend. You have some kiddos. Do you have plans for this weekend? They're going to be playing outside uh -huh. quite a bit this weekend. That's good. It's just going to be so sunny. Got to do it. Yeah. So looking forward they, to that. Yeah, and they are too. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun. And a lot of people probably will be spending time outside this weekend. Yep, absolutely. So yeah, we've got a great weekend in store. We are going to be a little bit cooler than we were this time last weekend. We aren't going to be breaking any records by any means, but it's still going to be a pretty pleasant weekend when all is said and done. Take a look at this time lapse of downtown Rochester. We had a gloomy start. We had some rain to our south and east, but those clouds moved out of the area really quickly and the skies cleared out. We had a beautiful sunset around six o'clock this evening and it has just turned into a beautiful night, although it is awfully chilly right now. Taking a look at downtown Rochester, currently 26 degrees with winds out of the north and northwest, 13 miles per hour. So we've got a wind chill right now of 15 degrees. So if you are still headed out yet tonight, you'll want to bundle up in that coat because it is going to be pretty chilly. Here are the clouds that I was talking about. They are moving their way across the Mississippi River, mostly into Wisconsin. And we've got high pressure that is going to be making its way to our area. That's what's going to be dominating the weather for the next several days with sunny skies and temperatures that are going to start warming up starting on Sunday. And the first part of next week is going to be absolutely wonderful when you take a look at the forecast here later on. Now for Saturday, we are looking pretty good. We're going to have the, the clouds are gone, as I was saying and the clear skies are going to be remaining. So we've got the sun that will be shining and really nothing to complain about in terms of clouds or rain or anything like that. So we've got a great weekend in store. Get out there and enjoy it. It's not gonna to be too cold and it's gonna be warming up quite nicely. Now, the other thing we've gotta be talking about is daylight saving time. That begins this Sunday at 2 a.m. We'll set our clocks ahead one hour. Most of us won't have to worry about it because our phones and all of our smartwatches do all of that automatically. So we're really not gonna to have to worry about doing much manual changing this weekend. 23 degrees for tonight, partly cloudy skies. Winds out of the northwest about 10 to 15 miles per hour for your weekend we're going to be in the 40s for the most part saturday will be the cooler day at 40 degrees with sunny skies on sunday same thing with the skies warming up to 47 degrees but take a look at this seven day forecast where your weekend is always in view there is that warm-up cami 65 degrees on monday 66 on tuesday before we cool down a little bit a chance of rain on thursday cooling down to the 40s and 50s